If you want to create high quality, engaging live streams from your Mac, you need to get the best live streaming software called Ecamm Live. You'll be able to live stream on Facebook, Periscope, Twitch, YouTube, or multiple platforms at once. You can also live stream using multiple cameras, such as a Canon, Logitech, or even your iPhone. You can add a professional touch by dragging in graphics, text, video file, even while you're live. You can also bring in multiple guests live with just one click. Hello everyone, I'm Eileen Smith, and today I want to tell you why I love using Ecamm Live whenever I stream. Ecamm Live has so many options that will help you engage with your audience, like putting comments up on screen, bringing in guests, and one of my favorite things that I love about Ecamm Live is that it can be used as a virtual cam with other applications and you can also use it to record pre-recorded segments. So thanks so much Herman for letting me come in and share my love for Ecamm Live. Hello, my name is Herman Drost. If you want to grow your audience on YouTube and generate traffic, leads, and sales on autopilot, hit the subscribe button and hit the bell notification icon to be notified about future videos. Let me give you a quick demonstration of how Ecamm Live software works. If I click on show hide overlays, then it'll, it'll show the overlays window. If I click on the audio, it'll show the blue snowball, built-in microphone. You can also do echo cancellation. If I click this icon, I can use a green screen. Currently I'm inside the Ecamm Live software window and I'm using record only, but I can use uh, per Facebook, Periscope, Twitch, YouTube, Restream, IO, and Switchboard Live, where I can live stream multiple platforms. But I'm using record only, so let's switch over. If my destination is YouTube, then I can select uh, public, unlisted, or private. I can also schedule a new event. So I'm just gonna do record only. If I want to switch cameras, I just go to the camera source and click on 1080p Pro Stream. As you can see, I'm now using the Logitech camera angle. If I want to switch back, I just go up to this camera source and click on Canon EOS M50. And here's the Canon M50. I can do the same for my iPhone camera as well, so you can have different angles for different cameras. I can connect all the cameras just using USB cords. That's pretty sweet. If I want to switch to presentation mode, I just click on the computer icon. Now it's showing the window for my keynote presentation as I go through the slides. I can also zoom in on the presentation or zoom out on the presentation. If I want to go back to the talking head, I just click on the camera. And here's the talking head again. I can import a video file from my overlays window. So I just click on the video file and it's imported. When I finish playing the video, I can just drag it off. I can also drag in images from my overlays window. I just click on the file and it appears. I can also zoom in on it, make it larger. When I've finished, I just drag it off the window. The beauty of this is that I can just drag and drop images, video files, etc. as I'm giving the presentation. When you're ready to go live, like on Facebook or YouTube, just click the Go Live button. While live, you can display comments from your audience, show graphics, text, and even video files. When I finish showing the comment, I can just drag it off the window. After you've finished, just click the Finish button, then click End Broadcast. You'll get a window that pops up saying the live broadcast has ended. And since I did this on Facebook, it said the video is now a post on your profile. I can view the post, delete the post, and it says a recording has been saved to my Mac. So I can show the file, or I can send it to YouTube also. Click OK. And now I'm back in my window where you can go live on Facebook, YouTube, Twitch, Periscope, etc. While your video is live on YouTube, you'll see the live chat stream next to the video. After you finish the live stream, your chat stream will appear below the video on YouTube. The Ecamm Live staff run a great Facebook group where you can get your questions answered and interact with other people that are using the Ecamm Live software. You can also keep up with the latest developments of the software. The standard plan is only $12 per month or $144 per year. However, I highly recommend getting the Pro plan, which is only $20 per month or $244 per year. It includes all the standard features, plus you get a virtual webcam, live video monitoring to any display or HDMI output, 
NDI output, audio monitor output, automatic Facebook page cross-posting, real-time bandwidth stats, and VIP tech support. Click the link in the description below to get your free trial now. You'll be glad you did. If you just want to live stream from your mobile phone, download my mobile live stream checklist below. You'll also learn how to prepare for your live stream and what to do afterwards. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video.